Hello, William. How are you? I go to tell. Good evening. Good evening. How's everything? What? How's everything? You okay? ¿Qué significa? Hello. Are you okay? Yes. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Remember that. Today we got a lot of work to do. And tell me, how was your day? Did you have a good day today? Uh, my day is... Uh, that's perfect, teacher. Was. Now, was. Now, was perfect. Sorry. Uh, now I went to I with my family uh, the supermarket. Okay. What time did you finish working? Uh, five twenty minutes. Oh, that's okay. No. Good schedule now. All, that's all nice, way, that's nice. Always follow a security pro protocol. That's very important. Digamos, uh, este, uh, al ir al supermarket. Follow a yeah, protocol. ¿Cómo sería protocol? Protocol. 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 Protocol security. No, security protocols. Security protocols. Uh, yeah, it's very important. I mean, we need to be safe and we have to we have to protect our family, our relatives. That's good. Uh, very important. Yes, uh, sure. This activity uh, for for the situation living in the country. Of course. I mean, nowadays the situation is very complex and we need to, to be careful all the time. Yes, always has to take care any, 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 cualquiera. I'm sorry? Uh, cualquiera, cualquiera. Any, yes. any. Any. In any uh, lugar sería any place. place any place yes you can say any place or another option is to use the expression uh, oh my father my father my father my father second Another option is to use the expression, let's see. The expression anywhere. Hold on. Let me text it for you. Okay. Anywhere. Like this. Cualquier lugar. Anywhere. Any place, anywhere. Yeah. Anywhere. This is uh, uh, every day, always uh, using security protocols. Yeah, of course, we have to, otherwise we are in trouble. Well, William, welcome to the class. Nice having you here today. Thanks. No, thanks to you. My pleasure. Maria Luisa, hello, how are you? Hi, teacher, how was Good evening. Good evening, how are you? I am fine, and you? Here, you know, working as usual, there's always something good to do. Okay. Only, only work. <laughs> yeah. Day. yeah. We have to, I can. Okay, I, but, and what about you? How was your day? Tell me. In the morning, I, I work in the office. 
In the afternoon, I go into. I went to. I, I went to meeting with my my clients. Oh, my clients very important. Okay, uh, then you have to say I have. I, I have, have two meetings. I have two meetings with clients. With no with with one with very client. important clients. Uh -huh. oh, see, we very important clients. Uh -huh. um, then, then, then after the meeting, I, I, I went, I went to a dinner with, with my, my friend. And then, then I, I went, uh, I went to, uh, I went to supermarket. Uh, then I, 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 I write, write, um, return to uh, my house. Okay, I return to my house. I, uh -huh. I return to my house. Uh -huh. And then I, I see, I saw, I saw my garden uh, because I, I, I like it. I like to my garden. Uh, I, I am happy the, the, I am happy for my, my plant, my my garden. I like to uh, take care of it. Cuidarlo. Uh -huh. Can I like it? Uh -huh. Then finally, I I I see I. I learn English with with my teacher in my guys. Uh, That's cool. <laughs> That's excellent. <laughs> it's good for you to be ready for the class. Thank Maria you. Lisa. Thank you very much and welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Teacher. Uh, yes. Uh, when, when, cuando se dice you're welcome, se dice thank you o welcome. You're welcome. Thank you're welcome means uh, por nada. Ajá, you're welcome. Ajá. Pero entonces. Uh, you're you're welcome, welcome is the answer to thank you. Ajá, thank you. Ay, que a veces escucho que dicen, cuando usted dice you're welcome, you're Porque welcome. Me ha dicho thank you. Ah, ok. Excelente. Y luego digo, welcome to the class. Ah, bienvenido a clase. Welcome to the class. ¿Sí? Yeah. Ah, yep. Entonces ahí le digo, thank you. Thanks. Yep. And I tell you, you're welcome. Ok. Thank you. <laughs> ok, thanks. Let's see. Thank you, Maria Luisa. Let's see. Who else do I have? Marta. Hello, Marta. How are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How's everything? Everything was very well. Really? Yes. Oh, that's nice to yes. hear. Tell me, what did you do today? And my day is uh, very busy, but I am happy because tomorrow is day off. <laughs> oh, yeah. My day was very busy, okay? Wow, yes. Sorry, teacher. And tomorrow, it's actually tomorrow, it's a holiday. Yes. Tomorrow is a holiday because it's independent. Class two? Yep. Tomorrow, okay. no class. Oh, so bad. 
Ah. Yeah, sure, sure. I know, I know. Teacher, I try. So bad, so bad, yeah. Don't yeah, trust and close. see, teacher. I was this close of believing you. Así es don't, don't trust and see, teacher. She is very bad. Okay, okay. Oh, no, the expression she... is don't, don't trust. She liar, liar. <laughs> She's a liar. Don't, she's a liar. Don't love her teacher. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she was like, yeah, yeah, so sad, so sad. And she got yeah. everything planned for tomorrow. What you doing tomorrow, Martha? Yeah, I think so. Um, a lot rest. Okay, Maybe. to rest. I think to rest a lot. I tend to rest a lot. Um, no more plans. <laughs> no plans, just to rest. Yes. That's quite interesting, actually. Yes, teacher. Because I'm oh. tired, very tired. So I You're need tired. to rest. Okay, okay, come on, it's just Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, but it's it's a Friday for me. I think so. <laughs> oh, interesting. Well, this week is going to be a little bit short, right? Yes. It's the day off is one day less. Yeah. That means that next week is going to feel oh, terrible. It's the last week, the, the class, teacher. Yes, we finish classes next uh, Thursday. Thursday is next week. Okay. The 23rd, oh, so if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you know, a good thing is that the next level is going to start pretty soon. It's, it's bad for me because when we have a class, uh, we, we practice every yeah. day. But, but that's, the, why, that's why I'm telling you, perhaps yes. next level is going to start pretty soon. Probablemente el próximo nivel comienza muy pronto. And actually, it depends on you guys. Depende de ustedes. How fast you turn in the paperwork. Que tan pronto mandemos eh, los documentos. Documentos. Okay. Yes, because I mean, the due date is next Friday. La fecha es el próximo sábado. If we send them on time, the course can start the 27th. And Monday. Iniciamos curso lunes 27. Next level. Uh, yep. It's good because uh, the practice is continuing. Yeah, and you advance. I mean, you advance faster. Yes. Well, welcome to the class, Marta. You're welcome, teacher. Thank you. Let's see. Shanira. Hello, Shanira. Hello, teacher. How is it going? How are you? Here? I'm really good. Because tomorrow is a holiday and I hope you are that... going to finally rest. Yes, I hope I wake up late, very late, and I take time or I spend time washing TV. That's good. Then That's I'm good. happy. Ooh, yeah. It's nice to finally hear that you are going to rest. Yeah, <laughs> I I want this teacher. I hope that I can. You need to rest. It's very important. Yes, I know, teacher. So tomorrow the plan is sleeping late and not doing doing the less possible. Yeah, so I. Uh, well, I I. I need to do some some something, but it's easy. Then I think that I finish 
early and the rest of the day I try to rest. Okay, that's nice. Yes. Don't get hooked up on the work. No se engancha en el trabajo. It's very important. Yes, I know. Not need to rest. Yes, yeah. yes. Great, great. Well, it's nice to have you here in class and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Let's see. Hey, Wilfredo, how are you? Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm just fine. What about you, Wilfredo? Very well, because tomorrow I am going to be at home. Yeah, you look tired today. Is it me or you look yeah. tired? So yo lo veo cansado. Yeah, because um, today um, we have to, I, I had to finish many reports to the, um, the payroll. Oh. With the, we are going to pay the, of, um, the, the this week um, um, on Thursday. But we oh have to gosh. introduce uh, many information in the system. But this week, teacher, we, we start to, um, to work with a new system to calculate the payment. In a That's system. always a problem. Yeah, but yesterday we start, but we have many, many troubles to start to work in the, in the system. But yeah, I know whenever today, we are trying a new system, we always have to encounter some difficulties. That's normal. Yeah, but nah, it is occupational hassle. We have to, yeah. to be. Uh, but I imagine that right now it's over, right? You finish it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's cool. But I start around 5 p.m. Then uh, I, I arrive at home to relax because tomorrow I'm going to be with my family. And I guess tomorrow I'm going to spend uh, a good time, good time with, with my family teacher. That's very important. It's always good to spend time with the family. That's yes. great. What That's you, the teacher? best of plans. Me, woo, tomorrow, let's see, gotta work. You are, you are addicted to, to, to the job teacher. Yeah, you know, I'm going to take advantage that tomorrow we are going to go out and I will, I will advance in a little project that I'm finishing. So, I mean, I'm going to be, tomorrow I'm going to be working as an electrician. Really? Yeah, Do most you know of the day. That? Yeah. My high school was in electricity. Yeah. Yeah, that's my, I, my brother, it is a electrical in, engineer. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, he, he works in IS in Hapa. Oh my gosh. The only bad thing is that it's hot. Nehapa is yeah. hot. Yes. He told me that. Hot. But he works in, in his office, only checking the monitor oh he's got ac <laughs> conditioner no problem yeah but when he finished his his schedule uh, he told me hey that, but he lives in san salvador but sometimes he told me he called me and, and he told me hey what are you going to do in, tomorrow at night uh, if i don't if i don't have any plan but I call him, uh, come on, and we spend a little time with him. That's cool. When he finishes his shift. His shift? Yeah, su turno, su jornada. Ah. Let me write it because. Yeah, yeah, it's because... always good. It's always good to get that type of vocabulary. Yeah, because. Uh, this week, teacher, we, we are going to start to, to I, I have another activity. We have to make some streaming lesson. Uh, have you, have you, 
No, about three that. Minutes. Three minutes lesson. Three. Lesson yeah. de tres minutos. When, oh, three minutes. When we, three minutes yeah, lesson. Three minutes lesson. When we start to package a new style, we have to teach to the people how they have to do it. But in in system, we have to 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 create. Um, how do you? How I can say you? Procedure. To, to teach him, to teach them. You have to create a step by step. Yes, 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 like that. And then, but it is full in English. We have to check the in system. The name is it is style packet, all the instructions, and, and another inform, information. But it is very good because it's a new vocabulary for me. It is technical yeah, vocabulary. Yeah, but you got to practice. To... Yes, sir. Another sure. chance to practice. And you know, when you're learning English, when you're learning any language, remember any chance you got to practice, you got to take advantage of it. Any any new word for me, it is, it is an opportunity to learn more teacher. Yeah, sure it is. Yeah. Hey, Wilfredo, nice talking to you and welcome to the class. And welcome to chat. Let's see who else is around. Hey, Walter, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Walter. Uh, How's everything? Uh, and everything fine, teacher. And everything fine. What did you do today? Oh. Uh, tomorrow in morning, and uh, mm -hmm. I prepare um, a report uh, for my boss. Okay. Uh, and, and I got new and always had the practice the sport uh, gym. Yes. Yeah, yes. And then after more or oh, and more and more. <laughs> okay. And tomorrow the teacher we will uh, go to work. <laughs> you will have to yes. work tomorrow? Yes, Ooh. yes. Overtime. The yes, the company has a lot of work. And as oh, but that means we have to, that means yes, more money. Yes, yes, yes. Cool. My company, my company, uh, 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 a lot of work. And as employees, uh, we have to collaborate. Yes. Uh, yes. Uh, there are there are work. There are what I work. Okay, well, the good thing is that the good thing is that there's going to be, I mean, extra payment. That's always good, but it's going yes. to be, it's, it's a hour. heavy week for you. Yes, yes, teacher. In the moment, my company, and uh, it, uh, nos necesita. Yeah, needles. Yeah, needles. Okay. So that means that you are pushing a lot, a lot of hours. Oh, yes. You're pushing a lot of hours right now. You are pushing a lot of hours, yes, teacher. Yeah, I am telling you that. You are pushing a lot of hours now. Well, yeah. that's good, always <laughs> good. Thank you very much, Walter, and welcome to the class. You're welcome, teacher. Okay, guys, let me get uh, attendance to start with and let's see Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez present thank you Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernandez present teacher Claudia Lizette Ramos Barrientos present Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia present teacher Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. 
Present teacher. Jose Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. Thank you. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Néstor Omar López Castro. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Carlos. Yes, I got your name. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Nuila. Jensi Elizabeth Miranda de Odanes. Present teacher. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Present. Thank you. Let me check. Okay, everything is in order. Let's see, Ambar. Hello, how are you, Ambar? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. What about you? You know, here, same old story. And tell me, Ambar, what's the plan for tomorrow? Tomorrow's a holiday. What you gonna do? Mm, I don't I don't have any plan. I I only I will watch a series on Netflix and maybe I will order food by the by delivery. Only that. Okay. That's nice, that's nice. So that means that you're going to rest as much as possible, Lambert. Yes, I, I will take, take a rest. Yeah. I, don't, I don't have any plans for tomorrow. Hmm. And, how, and how was today? How was your day? My day, it was relaxed in my work. I don't, I didn't have a lot of calls for today. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, well, that's good and bad at the same time, right? Yes, because I need to... To sell more. Sell more, yes. Okay. Well, you know, tomorrow's going to be another day. Let's hope things got better on Thursday and you get back on track. Yes, I hope to Thursday and Friday, it, it will be better days in my sales. Let's hope so. Thank you very much, Amber, and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Let's see. Let's see who else is around. Hey, Maria, how are you? Maria Alejandra. Hello, teacher, good evening. Good evening, how are you? I'm fine, and you? I'm just great, tell me, what's the plan for tomorrow? Teacher, I, tomorrow I work. Oh, really? Yes, <laughs> because my boss changed uh the other holiday holiday day we in dominican republic really and change at 24 september 24th okay september 24th is friday yes and well well but a friday is not a bad day for you to have a holiday right <laughs> It's a good deal. Hi. Um, 
In chains, um, the deal is many uh, don't work um, 24, uh, 24 of the of December, December 24. And change the other holiday, uh, second November, November. Uh -huh. To 31 of uh, December 31. Yes. And it's a the deal, the chain, um, different day. In I work at in September, November, but not work in December, the holiday days. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> that's quite <Yes>. interesting. <laughs> Let's see. Let's hope everything goes okay. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much, Miss. You're welcome, teacher. Oh, yes. Thank you. Let's see, Claudia. Hello, Claudia. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. I'm fine. And you? You know, here, same old story, working as usual, waiting for everything to come fine. Tell me, how was your day? Oh, I had a busy day. Really? Yes. I I taught I taught all day. Ooh. I teach. I taught. I taught. I taught all day. Oh really? You were teaching yeah, all day long. I don't, I, don't, I didn't have a break. Oh, um, that's bad. I I only have had time for lunch and no more. Ooh. And after that, yeah, I, that's difficult. Yes. <laughs> after that, I I went to the post office and I arrived at home at 6 p.m. He after that, I ate dinner. I had dinner. I had dinner. Sorry. I had dinner. Okay, well, but tomorrow you got a day off. Yes, I well, will visit tomorrow. my friend. Oh, that's nice. Where are you going to go? I mean, um, where do your friends live? She live in... I don't remember the name. Um, it's close to your house or far? No, far. Another department? No, in Santa Ana. Oh, okay. um, <laughs> oh, I know where is that. So yes. that's good. That's good that you're going to be around. Yes, it's it. Okay, well, enjoy your day, Miss. Thank you and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see. I still got time for three more of you. Let's see. Let's see who else is around. And hey Nicolas, how are you? Good evening. How are you, teacher? I'm just fine. What fine. about you? How was your day? Fine, thank you. Yeah. This day? Yeah, today. How was it? Uh, well, uh, I, uh, I was preparing a report on the state of the water system. Um, the water system is, is of um, Tacuba. So, uh, oh, really? Japan. Yeah, I know. Yes, is very inter inter interesting, and I is 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 very good. Uh, the stats, the states, is is the estado. 
the state, state of the state of uh, forest the coffee forest um, this property property properties property property are the uh, manejo yeah the the management Management. management. Um, okay. Uh, the management of the uh, the forest, the the, uh, the coffee forest is 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 good. And uh, the the activity is I that I I I trabajo. I work. Oh, there's work. There's work for the persons, for the persons in the community, in rural community, and okay. the planting is 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 yeah is a new plant. Is a new is a new forest. Uh, is is very good. Uh, the function for the uh, for the recharge recharge of water in the the soil. Okay, research, research, research. Oh no, no, no! I understand you. Yeah, I understand you for the for the water cycle. That is what you mean, right? Yes. Okay. The recharge? No. Yeah, you can use that. Okay. You can and use. Is, and tomorrow, what is the plan for tomorrow? Well, in tomorrow, I I will paint a room in my house. And okay, that's nice. Other activity is um, I will wash my clothes in the washing machine. Okay, I will do the laundry. Yeah, yes, in the, the laundry. Uh, uh, I would I will see a good pictures and okay. television or TV in in the in the afternoon. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. It's good that you can rest. Thank you very much, Nicolas, and welcome to the thank, class. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, Marcela, hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, you? Just fine, just fine. Tell me, what's the plan for tomorrow? Um, I will go to um, San Vicente. Okay, you're gonna go to San Vicente? Yeah. Where in I'm San Vicente? In Verapaz. I'm sorry. Oh, Verapaz. Sí. Yeah. Beautiful town. Very beautiful town. Bonito pueblo. Yeah. Yeah. It's fresh. Amazing. It's actually fresh. Yeah. That's nice. It's a, a good view for Valle de Yeah. They got nice weather. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I so hot. yeah, no, I mean, North Verapaz and Guadalupe are pretty fresh. Yes, yes. the weather is so cool. I love yeah. the weather. It's delicious, the weather there. That's nice. You are from there? My family. Okay, you got relatives there. That's nice. Yeah. Yes. That's nice. I got relatives in San Vicente, but in the other side, I got relatives in San Esteban. Um, yeah, my aunt, uh, she told me about our other place near to Rapaz when she was young, a teenager. Uh, she was uh, San Esteban. Uh, oh yeah, I know. Or, 
other um, Casemiro, uh, arriba de Guadalupe, uh, el tablón y el lugar es así. Uh -huh. mm, that's nice. Yeah. It's, it's always good to, to remember beautiful places. That's nice. Well, I hope you have fun tomorrow. Thank you very much, Marcela, and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Thanks to you. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa. Hello, mister. Francisco. Perhaps he's busy. Let's see who else is around. Hey, Roxana, how are you? Hello, Hello. Oh, there's Francisco. Hello, Francisco, how are you? You should give me, give me a, a second, give me a second. No problem, no problem. There's Roxana here in class. Let's see. Hello, Roxana, how are you? Hi, good evening. Good evening. I'm How fine. are you? You're fine. I'm tired of teacher. I was uh, really you you do nothing all day long. You just spend uh, your time yeah, like laying you need, down, you know. <laughs> you need always say that. But uh today it was a very stressful day because oh, really? I yeah, because we had some uh troubles in some payments and the middleman uh, didn't have uh, the payments on time. Ooh, so it, that's bad, that's yeah. bad. So the email and the phone all day, it was very um, sonando, ocupado, no sé. Ringing? It was, it was uh, full. It was ringing all day long. Ring, ringing all all day long so yeah. uh, i was uh, in a lot of um, meetings because we have uh, changes in the platform because uh, now we have used um new apps uh, authenticator so uh, the middleman needs to uh, descargar dobla Download. Download this app and um, synchronize them with uh, her platform, with the pl platform. So it's very difficult because nobody had a lot of uh, knowledge in com computers or apps mm -hmm. or something like that. So I, now, I have a lot of uh, cases like that about payments, about um, tokens, and it was very uh, stressful for me, but I hope so tomorrow uh, I will take a free day. Oh, really? That's nice. So in my day, it was very uh, busy, but it was okay at the end. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Excellent, thank you very much. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see. We need to move on to the next activity. Let's see. Okay, the next activity we are going to do, actually, guys, it's set, uh, it's from your manuals. From your manual on page number, 29, we got two questions. Those two questions, I just send them to you on your, on the WhatsApp group. And also I'll send it to the Zoom group. Let's see, oh my gosh. Okay, let's see. Okay, we got two questions. And the questions are, how are employees monitored at your company? What kind of documentation is used in your company to make sure employees are doing a good job? Those two questions you are going to discuss, but today I'm going to divide you in groups of three members per group, okay? So, 
we are going to do the exercise like this. In group number one, that is Daniel, Francisco, and Maria Alejandra, Daniel, uh, let's see, Daniel is going to be making the questions to Francisco and to Maria Alejandra. Group number two, Maria Luisa, Silvia, and Janira. Janiria, you are in charge of the questions. Group number three, Claudia Ramos, Wilfredo, and Jensi. Claudia, you are in charge of asking the questions. Group number four, Carlos, Marcela, and Walter. Carlos, you are in charge of asking the questions. Group number five, Ambar, Jose Osorio, and Roxana. Ambar, you're going to leave the questions, please. Group number six, Nicolas, Susana, and William. Nicolas, you are going to be asking the questions. And group number seven, Fabiola, Fernando, and Marta. Marta, you're going to be asking the questions. Guys, let's jump in. We are going to have five minutes to discuss that information, okay? Hi. Hello, Roxana. Hi. Hi. You made the chair. Where is yes. Amber? Or I don't know. She's not here, so you can start asking each other the questions. Okay. Okay. How are employees uh, monitor monitor? Uh, sorry. How are employees monitor the gains? I send a email or or I don't know maybe I think the es la única forma is the only way but For a specific process, no, I don't have. Oh, okay. And what about you, Francisco? Um, in my case, uh, it's similar to to Maria. Uh, <laughs> uh, we don't have a, a me too for monitoring and only we have uh, to do the activities and we have time for each activity. And, uh, what about reports? Do you have to fill in reports? Um, we have uh, money in uh, there are re uh, reports uh, that is sent to the teacher uh, for, for say, digamos que nosotros trabajamos para la Dirección General de Aduana, lo traducimos o lo decimos como... No, the full name in, in Spanish because it's a given, it's a given name. Es un nombre propio, se dice en español. Uh -huh. Okay, teacher. Um, there are a report that sent to Dirección General de Aduana, and uh, that report are uh, um, how do you uh, how do you say, teacher? Como contractuales, digamos que son contracts. Contracts. Contract. Okay, teacher. Uh, that report are our contract point 
Actually, yeah. those reports are then the, the way they monitor that you are fulfilling your job. Yes, teacher. Uh, uh, only uh, some reports uh, are of contract and other uh, uh, the reports are for maintenance department or, or for operation de de department. Um, but the report to Dirección General de Aduanas are very important. Uh, and, the, and then uh, uh, those reports uh, are uh, a specific order that uh, we, we send to, to them. Okay. That's quite interesting. I'll be back, guys. They take uh, a metric or key of or key for measure your activities and oh, that's okay. it when yeah when we was in when we stay at office we use a biometric system too we put the finger for read, um, I don't know, who do you say, where? Fingerprint. 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 Yeah, uh, read the fingerprint and this uh, send a report with uh, check in and check out. Okay. But now is we are in charge of fill uh, a chart with activities all week. Okay, that's, this is, that's uh, nice. El deber ser. How do you say that, teacher? Repeat again the phrase, please. Uh, ese es el deber ser. The most do. Oh, the okay. verse is must be. But okay. give me the context again, please. We talk about the question. And yeah, yeah. But I, where I, where do I, you where do you use that expression? Donde usa esa expresión? Así es como debe ser. That's what you mean. Yeah, es lo que debería de ser. Okay. That's a nice, a beautiful expression. That's the way. Like this. That's the way it should be. It should be. Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Should be. If we give a report uh, when we end um, uh, work, and in this report, uh, our boss only review and she say, she tell us if, if it's okay, but we don't have any specific report. Mm, what else? Um, uh, she counts the time, but she has the, the, her own control, but we don't, we, we don't see the control because this, this is used it's just for uh, give us, um, I don't know how to you say bonification, because if we, bonus. if we. Bonus, Yancy. Bonus, bonus. <laughs> bonus. <laughs> bonus. Uh, uh, because if we give our word on time, or oh, we do the, we, we do the things in the deadline, uh, we have a bonus, but if we do, <laughs> and that is a control, she, she has, but we don't. It's an internal control for, for her and her boss. They monitor it for a uh, of requirements, requests of 
uh, we send and the emails to the monitor that uh, what kind of documentation is it in your company? Mm, we made uh, our report and we describe all activities that we made every day and the time we uh, we gastar o, o lo hacemos. ¿En cuánto tiempo hacemos esa actividad? Oh, how many spend, how many time spending to make a uh, activity? Uh, yeah. uh, with that, and then when we, we, uh, we send the carpet of work to our supervisor, and uh, they check all the documents. And then uh, we send, send her, and with that, to in the documentary of. Oh, she, she know if we make a good job or, or no. Okay, you, you receive uh, retroalimentation uh, feedback. You receive a feedback about your job for your, uh, for your boss or your supervisor. Mm -hmm. Okay. You, Carlos. What about you, Carlos? Uh, okay, uh, in my work, boss, she check my my results, my work in every client. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you get a list for uh, policies in HubSpot? Yes, uh, in HubSpot, we, we will create a profile by client. Mm. We do profile, we need to insert the profile, information. Profile, profile, like that, perfect. We create a profile by client with his yes of course okay the teacher uh, uh, repeat the activity for william how are employees monitored at your company william please what Tell me. Our our employees monitor at your company. Every couple of hours, we make a report of its activities. And you, Susana? The, the version that the version that we that we use is is all. So the issue is. Yes, I know. Many, many people, many issues. Many issues, right. Every day. Yes. So I, I, I registered my, my daily.
Okay, let's just wait for everybody to come back. In a few seconds, they are going to be here. Okay, let's see. Mm, let's see who's gonna be. Who's gonna be? Who's gonna be? Uh, Fernando. Hello, Fernando. Hi, teacher. Tell me, what kind of documentation? Well, how are employees monitored at your company? Sorry, teacher. My my connection is is bad then. Can you repeat that the question, please? The question, it's how are employees monitored at your company? Uh, I come in, I come in with, with Martha that uh, we don't have a, a monitor specific, but we, we work with, with uh, a methodology uh, scrum. And we have a sprint that uh, for all month, and we programming at the beginning in, at the beginning of the month, and every day we have a follow up meetings to to describe the, the advance of the task. Okay, that's quite interesting. Thank you very much, and very specific. Let's see, what about you, uh, Shanira? Tell me. About How are employees monitored parents. at your company? Okay, in my case, uh, we have a, a chart and we, we fill this chart for all week and send all week to the boss, but that's the way it should be. Uh, this not happening all the time. I, I feel the chart, but I, I don't send it. Okay. I talk with and Silvia. What kind of, yes, tell me, tell me, tell me. I talk with, with Silvia Maria Luisa that when we, we are, when we was in, in the office, we, we use a, a biometric method to read the fingerprint and cameras in the build. And this in the company in charge of this um, equipment, send a report that about check-in and check-out. But now it's only this charge to make to, to make measure for, for check the employee's work. Janira, for checking. <laughs> for checking. Come on, Janira, remember, whenever you got four and you place another bird, you say for the bird goes in ING form, okay? Okay, teacher. Thank you I very much. To remember. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Okay, guys. Due to the factor, the time factor, I will not ask everybody, but I was checking. I stay from group to group and I checked out that you were doing the exercise. I congratulate you and the ones that I asked to monitor the performance of the exercise was well done. And thank you very much. Let me get the attendance because then we got another activity. Let's see. Okie dokie, we got Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. 
Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernández. Present teacher. Claudia Lisette Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Néstor Omar López Castro. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Oops, I made a mistake. I'm sorry, guys. Sorry, 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 sorry. Oh, here we go. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Thank you. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Calves. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Nuila. Present teacher. Jensi Elizabeth Miranda de Odanes. Present teacher. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Teacher. And yes. I don't. Yes, María my... Luisa Morales de Corpeño. I... No. I Susana Ortiz. Please, teacher. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, Susana. Yes, but I got your attendance. Don't worry. I got you. Okay, let's see. Well, now that you were talking to me, Susana, ya que me comentó usted, Susana. Please, Susana, your presentation. Are you ready? Sure. Your homework? Yes. Okay, let's yes, do it sure. right now. Okay. Susana. I talk, I'm talking about uh, history of salsa. This is my rhythm, it's my favorite. What is salsa? Definition, salsa is a type of Cuban dance from mambo, pachanga, aruba, arumba, as well as American dances such a swings a thump. Story fact about salsa. Salsa dancing involved and as dances and talk and two company salsa music, which what popular is, is that night uh, six sixteen six six. Uh, different regions on Latin America and United States have distinct, distinct mm -hmm. salsa style of their own, such as a Cuban, Puerto Rican, um, Colombian, and New York style. Salsa, salsa is a partner dance where and the land for long and serious as being a turn of partner to music. There are uh, two main style, style of salsa, liner and circular. And salsa dancing is an international dance 
that that can be can be a fun is a mouse metropolitan cities in the world okay susana would you mind stopping just a second uh, i Excuse will me. just just a second i will read again for everybody to hear the pronunciation just of certain words lo voy a leer de nuevo para que escuchen la pronunciación de algunas palabritas que se les escaparon okay oh, okay Salsa dancing evolved as a dance to accompany salsa music, which was popularized in the 1960s. 1960s. Different regions of Latin America and the United States have distinct salsa styles of their own, their own, Susana, such as Cuban, Puerto Rican, Colombian, and New York styles. Salsa is a partner dance where the lead leads the follow through a series of spins and turn pat patterns, patterns, Susana, patterns to music. There are two main styles of salsa, linear and circular. Salsa dancing is an international dance that can be found in most metropolitan cities in the world. Okay, just those little words that I stress for you, Susana. Solo esas palabritas que le mencioné. Please continue. Okay, okay, teacher. A type of salsa. A New York style. New York City is where salsa music original originated uh, and the style of salsa dances the original in series bear its name. Uh, Los Angeles style. Los Angeles dance salsa is dance on one where, where dancers break uh, forward and the first beat uh, of the music in con con contraction in New York style which is dance on two. Los Angeles state salsa is dance is in line. In contrast. Cu contrast. Okay. Cuban style. In Cuba, and popular dance is known as casino, was marketed as Cuban style, salsa or salsa Cuba. A word to distinct it from other salsa style. When the name was popular is in 19, 16, no, 17, 17. Nineteen uh, 1970s. 70s. Okay. Uh, casino is popular around the world. In Cuid, in a U Europe, Latin America, and North America. Famous artists and Celia Cruz, Hector Laburier, Franklin Ruiz, Gilberto Santa Rosa, Mar Anthony, and Eddie Santiago. And famous songs and in Spanish, Lluvia. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay, that's okay. That's okay, no problem, no problem. Excellent. Only, it's all right. Excellent, Only teacher. excellent. Thank you very much, well done. Okay, teacher. Okay, yeah, I love salsa. I love dancing salsa. Nice topic. Thank you, Susana. Let's see, now, now. Where's Nestor? Nestor not here. Oh, Nestor was traveling to his hometown. Shanira, please, your turn. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready, teacher. Please, let's do it. Okay, good evening, everybody. Spoiler alert. Today, I'll talk about of my of one of my favorite TV series, Dark, is a Germany suspense and fiction series. Has three seasons. Um, 
uh, this this series occurred in Germany. The first season was launched in December 2017. The second season was launched in June 2019. And finally, the last season was launched in June 2020. I watched it at the end of the last year by Netflix. Well, the history of Kieran Whedon is not a real city. The center plot of the movie show the weird connection between four families, Nielsen, Doppler, Cowan, and Tiedemann. Some travels in the time between four generations of these families show confession, on trust, lies, and slowly is revealed the truth. The travels occur suddenly in a cave. Here exists a warm hole under a nuclear center. Only the principal personage knows about this cave. The, the, personal, uh, the principal personnel has Jonas, Martha, Ulrich, Regina, and someone more. I don't remember. Sorry, um, Regina. I'm sorry to interrupt you. Are you talking about the main characters? Yeah. Okay, that, that would be the main characters, los personajes principales, right? Okay, okay. The main characters. Sorry to interrupt. Don't, don't worry, teacher. Okay, um, the village become too crazy for disappear of someone boys and all begun here. The first boy that disappeared was Michael Nielsen. All the people in the village thought this, but really was that he traveled in the time toward the past and he became in Jonah's father in the past, but in the present, he was a Jonah's friend. Well, not Jonah's friend, he was a brother-in-law Jonah's brother-in-law. Michael never knew how he traveled in the time. When he talks about this uh, with the people, the people thought that he was crazy. Then uh, one day he hanged himself. This is a reason that Jonas began to trace back the reason for his father took a fatal decision Fatal decision teacher or fatal decision? Fatal. Fatal decision. And it was like this, how he found the cave and began to travel in the time to the past and the future. He knows how to travel and he saw most the mysteries. The series led me a bitter flavor because stay unfinished. And you must to think what is the end is. For understand this series, I made a chart following the, in the principal, what do you say teacher? I'm sorry, main- Main characters. characters. Main characters, events and families. It was funny and entertaining. I watched for one week, I began I, I start at 6 p.m. and finish at around 2, 4 a.m. for five days. Was crazy. <laughs> and that's it, teacher. This is my history. Okay. Very well done. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Excellent, excellent, excellent. That's good. Let's see. For Thursday, I got uh, Jensi, Maria Alejandra, and Francisco. Don't forget it. You go on Thursday. And let's see, guys. Well, I will switch into a Spanish for a second. Eh, cambio el español por unos minutitos. Eh, creo que hoy nos cayó a todos un mensajito, ¿verdad? Se está ya recopilando la información para la inscripción del, del nuevo módulo. La fecha límite es este viernes. Es muy importante que nosotros tengamos toda la documentación a tiempo. Recuérdense que eso nos permite que este, se pueda abrir el grupo. ¿Ok? 
Entonces, si alguien tiene alguna dificultad o algo, nos avisa con tiempo y podemos ver cómo ayudamos con las gestiones. Esa es una aclaración. La otra, este, ya pronto les va a caer también el correo con lo de la encuesta de satisfacción. Recuérdense que esa, la encuesta de satisfacción, nosotros la vamos a resolver juntos en la última clase. Ok. Eh, déjenme ver. Las clases finalizan. Nosotros terminamos módulo el 23 de septiembre. Les recuerdo, como les dije al inicio de, de módulo, que este módulo era de cinco semanas, no de cuatro. Okay, nosotros tenemos 25 fechas. Yo les mencionaba, son niveles intermedios. Los niveles intermedios son un poquito más grandecitos. Eh, ¿Alguna pregunta antes de continuar? No, okay. Let's continue. Tomorrow guys. to rest in the class teacher. Yes, tomorrow no classes. Mañana Thanks. tenemos un asueto. Pero nos veremos de nuevo el jueves. Okay. Let's continue, guys. We have a lot to do tonight. My gosh. Okay. We have the model conversation. Let's see. Okay. The conversation goes like this. We are going to practice it. Then you will have time for you to do it. And then we are going to give it to the rest of the class. Just let me send you the image of the conversation as usual. Okay. And it goes like this. Where's Mario? He is late for his, for his shift. Mario? Goodness, I got a call that he is very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry, he should have called me directly. If he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. I repeat, where is Mario? He is late for his, for his shift. Mario, goodness. I got a call that he's very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. I repeat one last time. Where's Mario? He's late for his chief. Mario, goodness, I got a call, a call that he is very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Okay, guys, let me create the groups. You will have four minutes to practice that. Remember, you are going to practice both because some of you, vamos a practicar ambos, porque acuérdense que algunos de ustedes, I will ask you to perform both characters, okay? So groups are created, please jump in. Umbar, they abound, abandoned you. No, 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 no. Yes, I don't have partner. Don't worry. I'll send you to another group right now.
you have called call me directly if he have called to my phone i could have a phone a substitute by now i have time this afternoon let me cover for him where is mario he's late for his chief mario goodness i got a call that he is very sick he should have told you early don't worry he should have called me directly if he had called me it pardon if he had called to me i should have earlier don't worry he should have called me directly if he had called me to my phone i could have found a substitute by now Don't worry, he should have called me directly. If he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have signed this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Okay, girls, I start. Okay. Where's Mario? He's late for his shift. Mario, goodness, I got a call that he is very sick. I should have told him. Don't worry, he should have called me directly. If he had called my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me call it for him. Again, uh, where is Mario? Is it for this sheet? Mario, goodness, I got a call that he is very sick. I should have told you early. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me go for him. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. I start. Where's Mario? It's late for this chief. Mario, call this.
Okay, let's see, let's see. Maria Alejandra and Marta. Maria Alejandra, you start. Okay. Where's Mario? He is late for his chief. Mario, goodness. I got a call that he is very sick. I should have to you early. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Perfect. Nicolas and Ambar. Nicolas, you start. Okay. Where's Mario? He's a late for his shift. Mario, goodness, I got a call that he is very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry. He should have called, called me directly. If he had called it to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Perfect. Excellent, both of you. Claudia Ramos and William. William, you'll start. Where is Mario? He is late for his chief. Mario, goodness. I got a call that he is very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry, he should have called me directly. If he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time. I have time the afternoon. Let me cover for him. Perfect. Excellent dog. Fabiola and Roxana. Fabiola, you start, please. Where is Mario? He is late for his chip. Mario, goodness, I got a call that he's very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If I called my phone, I could have a phone a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Perfect, thank you very much. Jose Osorio and Walter. Please, Jose, you start. Okay, teacher. Where's Mario? He is late for his shift. I got in a call that is very sick. I still have told you earlier. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If he, he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I had time this afternoon. Let me call him for him. Perfect. Thank you very much, both of you. Just remember, should, could, letter L, no sound, okay? It doesn't have a sound in there. We say should, could. Thank you, guys. Uh, okay. Daniel and Marcela. Daniel, you start, please. Okay, teacher. Where's Mario? He is late for his shift. Mario, I got a call that he's very sick. I should have told early. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If he had called me to, if he had called to my phone, I could found, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Perfect. Thank you very much. Fernando and Susana. Fernando, you'll start. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Where is Mario? He is late for his shift. Mario, goodness. 
I got a call that he is very sick. I should have told you early. Don't worry, he should have called me directly. directly. If he had called it to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Okay, thank you. Maria Luisa and Wilfredo. Wilfredo, you'll start. Okay, teacher. What is Mario? He's late for his chief. Mario? Goodness. I got the Gorat call me. Call that he is very sick. I should have told you early. Don't worry. He should have called me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ah, Maria Luisa. Don't worry, he should have called me. Yes, that was Don't your worry. part. That was your part, Wilfredo. Okay. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If I had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute for by now. I have tied this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Okay, thank you very much, both of you. And Carlos and Francisco. Carlos, you'll start. Okay, teacher. Where is Mario? He's late for his shift. Francisco? Can you tell me? Okay, let's see. So, okay, perfect. Let's start, Carlos. Okay, okay. What is Mario? He's late for his seat. Mario, goodness, I got a call that he is very sick. I should have told you early. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If he had called to, call it to me to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this after all. Let me cover for him. Perfect. Thank you. Sylvia and Jency. Sylvia, you start. Where is Mario? He's late for his shift. Mario, goodness, I got a call that he's very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry, he should have called me early. If he had called me to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me, let me cover for him. Very well done. Thank you very much. Uh, let's see. Now, Shanira and Fernando. Shanira, you will start. Where is Mario? He is late for his shift. Mario, goodness, I got a call that he is very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry. He should have called me directly. If he had called to my phone, I could have found a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Okay, perfect. Now let's see. Oh. 
Okay, guys, let me show you something that you will have to do as a homework. In your manual, in page number 29, exercise four, that's going to be a homework for you. Okay, let me share it with you. Teacher. Yes. What page did you tell us? Right now, I'm going to show it to you. It's page number 29. Okay, thank you. Exercise four. You see, have you ever got a last minute notice about a member of your staff not going to work? How did you handle the situation? Did you get a substitute? Did you assume some of the absent employees' responsibility? Okay, you are going to answer those questions. Okay. That's your homework, guys. Now, let me continue. Okay. Let's see. We have how to use perfect models. Look at the examples in the box. Use perfect models to express regret or remorse about past actions. We use should have plus the past participle of the verb to talk about regrets, okay? I should have sent the report sooner. I shouldn't have asked her to carry those boxes, okay? Look at this, could. Could and will are often used with if. If plus how plus the past participle. If I had known you were sick, I could have gotten a substitute. The manager could have fixed your schedule if you had mentioned it to him. I would have come to work if I had received the schedule on time. You see, in this case, it is used as a part of the conditional sentence. And you already know the conditional sentences. We saw them in previous courses. But let's do the exercise. The exercise number six. Complete the sentences we should, could, will have plus past participle. Okay, guys, what are you going to do? I'm going to divide you. In pairs, you will have just three minutes to do this exercise. We are talking about page number 30, exercise six, okay? Page 30, exercise six. Let's do it. Please jump in. Hey, Wilfredo, you didn't get the invitation?
Finish, ladies. No, teacher. I check her. Hurry up, hurry up. Bean. Teacher, I'm confused. Number exercise. Number three. I think that the number three is the servers would have been in trouble. No. The servers would have been in trouble. Yes. That's okay. perfect. Okay. tan perdida. Would have been. Okay. The, the number four is you should add mm, should, mm, number six. I should have called to let the manager. Let the manager. Uh -huh. I was sick. Okay. okay. And then repeat the bartender uh, shouldn't have taken that bottle of wine without permission. Number three, the servers would have been in trouble if they had been late for the meeting. Okay, or do you have asked the manager for a day off? The cashier shouldn't have taken the money from the register. And six, I should have called to let the manager I was sick. And that's it. And that's I it. Think we have it. Um, take. Shouldn't, take. Shouldn't have uh -huh. which the one? bartender shouldn't have taken that bottle of wine. The bartender should not have taken the bottle of wine without permission. Take and in, in base should part. not have taken taken. Uh -huh. uh, taken. Um, it's a uh, in in it's past present is, perfect. Uh huh. Yes. Present taken is present perfect. Yes, have taken. El presente perfecto se forma si usted se recuerda con el auxiliar have y el verbo principal en pasado participio. En pasado, uh -huh. Y expresamos haber tomado en ese caso. Haber tomado, ok. Okay, uh, number three, the servers will would have would have, have been would have been uh -huh. the the servers the servers would would have been in trouble if they had been late for for the meeting. Okay, and number four, you should you should have asked it. You had
Let's see, we're just waiting for everybody to come back. In a few seconds. Yeah, just a few seconds. Okay, guys, due to the factor of the time that is running short on us, I will read you the sentences. You can check it out, okay? I hope that's fine with you. Let me just get it uh, over here. Okay, let's see. Number two, the bartender should not have taken that bottle of wine without permission. The bartender should not have taken that bottle of wine without permission. Number three, the servers will have been in trouble if they had been late for the meeting. I repeat, the servers would have been in trouble if they had been late for the meeting. Number four, you should have asked the manager for a day off. I repeat, you should have asked the manager for a day off. Number five, the cashier should not have taken that money from the register. I repeat, the cashier should not have taken that money from the register. And finally, number six, I should have called to let the manager, I was sick. Oops, there was a mistake here, not to let, to tell the manager. I repeat, and in this case, the sentence is like this. I should have called to tell the manager I was sick. Okay, sure. guys. Sure. Yes. Will you repeat the last one, please? N number six. I should. I yep. should have called. I should have called. Um, okay. Ah, uh, okay, 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 okay. I should have Perfect. called. Thank you. No, thanks to you. Okay, guys, before we move on, so I do not forget, let me get the attendance one last time. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernández. Present teacher. Claudia Elisette Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Néstor Omar López Castro. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Thank you, Nicolás. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. Thank you. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Nuila. Present teacher. Jensi Elizabeth Miranda de Odanes. 
present teacher? Fabiola Georgina Silva. Present. Okay. Perfect. Thank you very much to all of you. Eh, nuevamente, repito las instrucciones generales. Recuérdense que según el mensaje que les enviaron el día de ahora, y para no confundirnos, mejor veámoslo directamente. Ok, nos decían de que se está solicitando los documentos de reinscripción a recursos humanos y por mensajes de WhatsApp a cada participante para el siguiente módulo con fecha tentativa de inicio 27 de septiembre. Es importante que ustedes estén al tanto de estos procesos para poder solicitar el apoyo a su empresa con el envío de sus documentos. Por favor, verifiquen con su empresa que los documentos hayan sido enviados a tiempo. Recuérdese que solamente al recibir la documentación completa y correcta, procederemos a reservar su próxima beca de estudio, la cual queda sujeta a que el participante apruebe el presente módulo, obviamente. Y la fecha límite de recepción de documentos se ha puesto para el próximo viernes 17 de septiembre, así que tenemos un poquito de tiempo, ¿verdad? Hagamos. Es sure. posible. Este. Yes. Sí, Wilfredo. Ah, yeah. eh, hoy, hoy me pareció ver en un chat que... Bueno, este... Eh, mm, 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 en mi empresa como que hay un alguien que se llama Jonathan, le escribió a alguien y le dijo que, que, que en la empresa pues hay alguien que, que como que se encarga de la documentación directo con alguien de okay. Isafor o no sé. En algunas empresas de ustedes, sí, Jonathan es uno de los colaboradores del área técnica. En algunas empresas este, ya hay una persona designada, ¿verdad? Pero uh -huh. nosotros les hacemos saber a ustedes de que el proceso ya está, porque ustedes tienen que igual firmar un documento, ¿no? Cada inscripción okay. que hacen. Entonces, es para que estén uh -huh. este, atentos a que el proceso se está dando. Y uh -huh. si tenemos okay. alguna duda de si la documentación está completa o si falta documentación, podemos este, hacer preguntar a la empresa o preguntar a la gente de soporte de inglés corporativo. Vaya, la compañera acá nos comenta este, de que ella ya envió todo y de que ya está aprobada en el caso de ella, ¿verdad? Eh, Claudia nos comenta que ya envió okay. la documentación y que ya fue aprobada. Entonces, en algunos casos lo hacen directamente el alumno, en otros lo hace la empresa. Ok. Este, ¿Hay otra preguntita por ahí? No, no, no. Uh, uh, today I... I... I remember I, I, I saw a chat, but the people in my company asking for this, this chat. But Jonathan told, told us that in our company, it is a person in charge to, to, to give this, this information. But it's Thanks. okay, teacher. Thank you. Perfect. No, thanks to you guys. And any question, please don't hesitate. Cualquier duda, por favor, me escriben. Ya todos tienen mi nuevo número, ¿verdad? Ya lo identificaron. Cualquier cosa, escríbanme y con gusto les apoyamos. Thank you very much, guys. See you tomorrow. Well, no, I'm sorry, not tomorrow. tomorrow. Thursday. Tomorrow, tomorrow is a holiday. It's a holiday. Yes. Are you going to see that? Happy Independence Day. Okay. Yeah, not Bye. all the companies. See you. Bye. Bye. Take hey, care. Have a good night. Bye. Good night, everybody. Hey, teacher, I have a, a question for the finish. Yeah, sure, no problem, Nicolás. Okay. Eh, la vez pasada, usted me indicaba sobre unas, sobre la, en la plataforma, sobre las opciones que había para poder encontrar vocabulario, eh, y, otras, yes, yes. Y, otro, y otros temas pero no lo encontré lo busqué y, y no sé si me habré confundido pero lo busqué y no lo encontré ninguna de esas de esas okay, pero quería ver si podemos verlo solo un instante porque si tengo a alguien programado que se lo ah. voy a mostrar pero permítame, permítame, no se me vaya 
Solo en un segundo que me cargue esto. A mí me toca, ¿verdad? Sí. Pero, permítame. Ok. Ok, let's see. ¿Puede ver acá? Sí. Abajo a centro de ayuda. Centro de ayuda. En centro de ayuda, nuevamente hasta abajo, recursos académicos. Y ahí encuentro usted grammar, pronunciation, vocabulary, okay. y conferencias. Ok. Académicos. Ok, teacher, gracias. No problem. Thank you very much. Have a good, good night. night. Good night, everybody. Bye. Good night, Nicholas. Good night. Okay. Hello, William. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo estamos? Very well, teacher. Okay, William. En su caso. Sí vamos a revisar esto del centro de ayuda porque hay un par de cositas que quiero que me trabaje, ¿ok? okay. ¿Se acuerda cómo llegamos acá, verdad? Sí, ahorita acaba de ver. Ok. Primero me gustaría que entrase usted en su tiempo libre al área de vocabulario. Es importante que adquiramos la mayor cantidad de vocabulario posible. Y usted acá va a encontrar de temas... Le recomendaría que busque los temas que le son, que siente usted que le falta más vocabulario. ¿Ok? Oh, Mire, acá oh. tiene una gran cantidad. Tienes animals, family members, eh, the dining room, the kitchen, cuando hablamos de las partes de la casa, the airport, public transportation, highway. O sea, hay vocabulario de áreas muy, muy distintas. Y eso le puede servir a usted como para aprender más. Ahora bien, no solamente quiero que se meta al área de vocabulario. También les recomiendo que me le dé una ojeada al área de gramática. Yo le recomendaría acá, a pesar de que estamos en un nivel intermedio, que usted comenzara trabajando en el área básica. ¿Sí? ¿Por sí. qué? Porque mire, acá tenemos distintos puntos gramaticales. Tenemos the present of be, imperatives, adjective modifiers, the future with be going to, o sea, tenemos una gran cantidad, pero primero, como le decía, vocabulary. Hay que enfocarnos muchísimo en vocabulario. Ok, because you understand a lot. Usted me entiende mucho. But when you want to speak, cuando usted quiere hablar, como que se me quedará corto por la falta de vocabulario, lo siento a veces. Sí, teacher, este, se me olvida muchas cosas en el momento. Ok, parte de los Antes ejercicios de la, que yo le recomendaría. Clase. Antes sí, de la dígame. clase, me ando, ay, esta palabra, esto, y esto, ya en el momento de hablar, sí. se me van. Mire, el vocabulario es cuestión de práctica. Es la única manera que usted lo va a adquirir, es cuestión de práctica. Trate de no buscar, por ejemplo, si usted se vaya, hoy me voy a enfocar en vocabulario de las cosas de la casa. No trate de aprenderse un listado grande de palabras. Trate de aprenderse tres, cuatro palabras en el día. ¿Pero cómo? Aprenderse la palabra y tratar de usarla en oraciones, en algo que usted vea a su alrededor, en el día a día. Meterlas en un contexto que sea normal para nosotros. De esa manera, se va a volver más fácil para ustedes recordarlas. Yes. Pero como le digo, el ejercicio, la clave acá... William no está en querer abarcar una gran cantidad de vocabulario de un solo. La clave acá es poquito vocabulario, unas cuantas palabras, pero bien aplicadas, bien repetidas, puestas en distintos contextos, puestas en oraciones. Así es como usted puede mejorar el nivel de vocabulario. Ahora dígame. Ahora, dígame, ¿is there any topic that you would like me to help you? 
¿Hay algún tema que le gustaría un poquito de ayuda extra? Este, eh, pas, eh, simple paz. Ok. Nuevamente, si se va usted a lo que veíamos acá, si nos venimos nosotros acá al recurso que le mostraba de la plataforma, ¿se acuerda? Yes. Ok, veamos. Aquí no habíamos puesto The Present. Aquí tenemos, mire, The Pass of B and The Simple Pass. ¿Lo identifica? Yes, yes. Number eight. Number number three and number eight. Let's do something. Hagamos algo porque es un tema bastante larguito de explicar. Vea la información, analícela. Y cada duda que le vaya surgiendo, comuníquese conmigo, mándeme un mensaje, mándeme una foto, si hay un ejercicio que no entiende, algún concepto que no le quede claro, y yo le puedo dar una retroalimentación. ¿Le parece? Tomorrow I see the lesson. Ok, perfect, perfect. Y ahorita lo bueno es que tenemos tiempo, o sea, si es necesario dar un espacio, una explicación más grande, yo le aviso y le aparto 10 minutitos al final de una de las clases. Ok, teacher. Le, no sé qué le parece. Le voy a dar. Uh, excellent idea. Solamente necesito, eso sí, que lo vea, que lo analice. Si tiene problemas a la hora de entrar a la plataforma, se le olvida alguno de los pases donde encontramos, también me comunica y yo le ayudo, ok. Tomorrow begin con... Perfect, perfect. That's the correct attitude. Esa es la actitud perfecta. Well, mister, it's a pleasure for me to be of help for you. Okay. Un placer para mí el haberle ayudado. Have a good night. Rest. It's a pleasure too. Good night. Bye bye, William. Take care. Thanks. Thanks, teacher. No, thanks to you. Well, it's time to see you. Well, not tomorrow. Next class, take care. Have a good night.